Hey you Lieben, what's good? What's going on? It's Yeshe, YeshoBoyton.com and in this video I'm going to take you to the Creation Museum in Kentucky. I'm going to show you our experience and a review and tell you if you should or shouldn't go, so stick to the very end to find out. This video is part two of a two-part series. Part one is the Ark Encounter and also the experience and the review. You can watch it right here. Yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. We're here, we made it, we're at the Creation Museum, let's see what awaits us. We're going to the dinos? Where are the dinos? Right here. Right there. Mommy sponsored kettle corn. So according to my son, this fella is a narky wash. So this is a complete new concept to me that I just have to digest right now. The point that they're making that dinosaurs actually coexisted with humans at some point. That's just so against what I was taught in school. Something I just have to process here. That's, this, is, this is a lot, man. This is, this is a lot. I get the point. They kind of just put a question mark to it and kind of like, is it possible? They use scripture to back it up, but man, and also, what is this kid trying to do here? Is it trying to, trying to kill that squirrel with the, what is going on here? So we're right now in the planetarium. We're gonna look at stars and star formations and stuff like that. It's gonna be really cool. I think yeah. the last time I was in the planetarium, I was a teenager. This is gonna be fun. This is gonna be a lot of fun. So for me who comes from Florida, well, for me who comes from Germany to Florida to Kentucky, is really a nice memory, refreshing of memory and feels like Germany almost. Being here in Kentucky, it's not so humid. It's just a nice, very nice summer day. Nature is very similar to Germany and it's just 
It's just so beautiful here, the garden, the way they did it, it's just amazing. Flowers, nature, the, the little rivers and the little waterfalls that they have here. I definitely would recommend coming here. The museum is very well put together, very thought-provoking. The whole idea with the dinosaurs being present even after the flood and all that is very thought-provoking to me and something I have to figure out myself. Great places here to play for the, for the kids over there. It's just a, just a nice playground. Great places to just picnic and enjoy the scenery. Behind me here is a wonderful waterfall. The garden is beautiful, wonderful flowers. It's a great place to just chill and just have a rest, maybe even pray. They have a petting zoo as well, where you can even feed the animals if you want to. You can pet the animals, obviously, for the kids. They have a climbing thing with a zip line for teenagers, which is great. A uh, big pond with ducks and everything. It's just beautiful. It's just a wonderful experience. I can highly recommend it. Spend the money, learn about creation, learn about the differences between creation and evolution theory. We watched the planetarium show, which was great. It's just wonderful. And uh, yeah, I would give it, give it a thumbs up and recommend you coming here to the Creation Museum in Kentucky close to the Ohio border Cincinnati close to Cincinnati if you get the chance to come here do it If you stuck around all the way to this point of the video, thank you so much for your time and for watching this video. Make sure to check out our Ark Encounter review and experience that's popping up on the screen right now. Or just watch the YouTube recommendation that's popping up. In any case, I'm going to see you in the next video and always remember, keep your eyes on the prize.